Well, good evening. Uh, how are you tonight? Well, that is very good. Now, I know you can't answer, but I want you to think about what you had for breakfast today. And if you didn't have breakfast, what did you have for lunch? And if you didn't have lunch, what did you have for dinner? Now, by chance, you most likely had a uh, an item of food that had meat in it. Now, according to Quora.com, only 6% of the United States population identify as vegetarian or vegan. That means 94% of Americans eat meat. But how many of them are willing to take the life of an animal in order to eat that meat? Being that the mass majority of Americans are meat eaters, we have to discuss if hunting is a good thing or not because some people eat meat, but they disagree with hunting. Now, when we look at hunting, we have to think about how every civilization throughout history, and even currently, has hunting going on actively. We have deer hunting in the U.S., uh, mountain lions, bear hunting, elk, moose, ram, uh, wild hogs, all kinds of hunting just here in the U.S. And then there's African safaris that people go on. So all over the world and every culture, everyone practices hunting. We also have to look at how hunting benefits man. Uh, why would we do this? Why would we kill other living things? if we didn't have to. We also have to look about how hunting helps nature and the good things that it does, not only for man, but also for our planet. Now, when I say nearly every, every civilization has practiced hunting, I mean every civilization. Uh, even in biblical times, they sacrificed goats. They, they killed animals in order to eat them. Now, Today, this is starting to be frowned upon. But if we don't look at the history, we don't know how things happen. Now, why did our ancestors do this? Well, they did it because they had to. It was kill or be killed. They also did it for sport at times. Uh, they would go and they would, Indian tribes, they would get their turkey feathers and make headdresses and such things as a, as a form of art. But every Indian tribe had respect for the animals that they took the lives of. For example, the Yaqui Indians have a thing called the deer dance. Now, the deer dance uh, admires deer and their elegance, and it also thanks them for their sustenance that they provide for the tribes. Now, let's talk about the benefits of hunting. For the hunter, it provides food and sustenance so you can live now a good juicy steak will fill me up for about three and a half hours and i'm not going to go get another juicy steak right afterwards i'll eat other things but it really helps me fill up it also gives a hunter a sense of a therapeutic time because being out in nature and seeing things uh really helps you admire the planet and calm down and, en and enjoy the planet God put us on. It also provides other useful materials like hide for clothing uh, with alligator. People use purses and then there's a whole fur trade that people use. But you can also use antlers for things like dog bones because they don't, they don't wear easily. It also is a method of maintaining farmland because some animals are peskier than others and we don't want to have them ruining our plants that we also need for food. Now, we have to look how it benefits nature because we wouldn't do it just for ourselves. We have to follow the creation mandate and do what's right for the planet. One thing it does for nature is it maintains animal populations and regulates ecosystems. 
if there was a bunch of rabbits, we wouldn't have as many weeds. And if we didn't have as many weeds, we would have a lot of problems in, in the herbal side of the ecosystem. But also, if there's too many deer, there's not going to be enough grazing, grass, and other things for other animals. It also provides for a more healthy gene pool of animals. Because hunters tend to target uh, animals sometimes that are less desirable so that their land maintains a healthy environment and the good genes are passed on into the next generation. Also, according to Lawrence Calhoun, it is a much more humane and painless death than the death they would face in the wild from things like starvation and other predators that can't uh, take their life as efficiently. Hunting is a good thing, and it always has been a good thing throughout history. It is a good thing for man, and it is a good thing for nature. Hunting isn't just a useless and ruthless activity where we kill animals for no purpose. It is actually very beneficial for man and very beneficial for nature. So please, if I have convinced you, go convince others so we can maintain a happy planet. Thank you very much.